Within Magento, the most commonly used WYSIWYG editing is done in the CMS section when creating pages or static blocks. This is what a WYSIWYG editor looks like in Magento. The top line of the WYSIWYG editor refers to the font styling elements available to create your content with. This includes similar features to a word processing tool such as bold, italic, underline and alignment. Highlighting your text and clicking on one of these buttons will make the corresponding change. Further right are the font styling elements, format, family and size. You should choose appropriate headings from the format drop down in order to increase your website's search engine optimization. For example, all main headings should be in a H1, all subheadings should be in a H2, and all main body content in paragraph format. You can do this by highlighting your text and selecting one of these format settings. The first section of the second line, highlighted here, displays the written formatting elements, including cut, copy, paste, paste as plain text, and paste from Word. The use of cut, copy and paste are fine. However, all copying from external documents should first be copied into a program called Notepad and then pasted into the WYSIWYG. This will eliminate any previous formatting that could interrupt or override the WYSIWYG formatting. The following are some of the most commonly used WYSIWYG features. Click this icon to insert a table. Click this icon to insert an image. Click this icon to open the HTML editing window. Click this icon to insert a hyperlink. 